Hey, this is Tony at Rupp Manufacturing. Today we're going to go a product overview of our mini disc mulcher. Now, these things you can get in three different sizes, 28 inch, which is shown here, 36 inch, or 48 inch. And we can put these on excavators up to say 6,000 pounds to 40,000 pounds. All right, the decks on our mini mulchers are standard quarter inch deck. As you can see, the blades are fully exposed on this side so you can get to the material, which it'll cut four to six inch material or mulch four to six inch material. You got a protective guard right here because of the clockwise rotation. This keeps it from throwing brush and debris all over the place. Another standard feature on our disc mulcher is your AR400 plate back here with the built in teeth. Now this is the half inch thick. You use it for grubbing, light grubbing, raking your stuff up in a pile, or you can use it in conjunction with your thumb. And that brings us to another option you have, just like the tree slayer you have on the disc mulcher. If you don't have dual auxiliaries, you can add a selector valve. Now we've got the selector valve installed already on this one. Basically what that does is you've got a solenoid that's mounted inside the cover, and that enables you to switch to the mulcher or to your thumb. The hoses, you've got extra hoses that run to your thumb, and then your thumb lines plug into there, and then you run the cutter straight to your auxiliary. This two-way switch mounts in your cab via the magnet. And you stick it right inside your cab. You go one way, you shoot the hydraulic fluid to the mulcher. Other way, it goes right to your thumb. As with all of our cutters, the, this mulcher also comes standard with eight-foot machine hose and half-inch flat face couplers. Now again, this one has the selector valve installed. That's why you see the extra two hoses. You know, generally speaking, if you don't get the selector valve, you'll just have two hoses. Some machines require a case drain to run this due to the direct drive motor and the pressure. So it already comes ported for a case drain in case your machine should exceed the 300 pounds on the return. But everything's there, plumbed and ready. Our disc mulcher also comes complete with the hookup for your machine. Shown here is a CAT 302.7, but we can put anything on there that you've got. And like all of our attachments, we put it simple where you just bolt on the plate because people's always changing machines. As long as something like this, if you're staying the same gallon per minute flow on your auxiliaries, all you have to do when you get another machine, unbolt this one, get another plate, bolt it right on, and you're still good to go. Now we got the business end of our mini disc mulcher, which is my favorite part. You got two 3 8 pieces that hold the teeth together with built-in clean outs. And what the clean out does, basically just knocks the little piece out when you're stump grinding teeth. That does your chewing, clean out just knocks a little gap out. You also got the carbide teeth on the bottom, so if you want to set on top of something and just crunch it down to nothing, that enables you to do so. The tooth holder is held on by a six bolt flange. Now what a lot of people always ask is, how does it do on grass? Well, these teeth don't do great on grass because they're just for brush, but we've got an option for the grass. You can also get the blade carrier. You want to get your grass, you simply take off the six bolts, pull the tooth holder off, pop the blade holder on, and you've got a wicked grass cutter. All right, well this has been an overview of our disc mulcher. Once again, it's rated for machines up to six, from 6,000 all the way up to 40,000 pounds. Comes in three sizes, 28 inch, 36 inch, and 48 inch. Great option. If you're looking to get into the mulching business and don't want to spend twenty to thirty thousand dollars on a drum style mulcher, this is an absolutely excellent option. It does a great job. Four to six inch material, no problem. If you want to cut your grass, go back to the blade holder with the cut the grass. Another option is a selector valve. If you got any more questions, want to see the product, check out our website. It's www.rutmfg.com.